Thank you to Organic Basics for sponsoring today's video. It seems like there's always a new emerging health and wellness trend. The new detox drink, a foolproof workout routine, the cure-it-all diet, the next superfood. And I'm not saying that they don't have their benefits, but sometimes it can feel overwhelming and achieving a healthy lifestyle can seem unattainable for so many of us. However, I don't think that it has to be this complicated or expensive. For me, I have felt my healthiest and happiest when balancing what I want versus what I need. And consistency has been the key. Now, more than ever, I feel it's important to take care of ourselves, mentally and physically. So today, I wanted to share with you guys the simple, tried and true, healthy habits that has changed my life for the better. First, finding exercise that works for me and my body. I wish that someone told me this a long time ago, and maybe then I wouldn't have felt the pressure to get a gym membership, nor would I have used this as an excuse for not working out. Exercise comes in many different forms, and we can choose to do the one that we actually enjoy. Instead of going to a gym or any class, I prefer to exercise on my own, at my own pace either by running, yoga, swimming, or surfing, whatever to get my heart pumping, tone, and strengthen my body. After each session, I'm always in a better mood, and this encourages me to eat healthier as well. It's a healthy cycle. Before we move on, I wanted to talk to you guys more about today's sponsor, Organic Basics. They recently launched their active wear collection and they were kind enough to send me their active crop top and active bike shorts, which I'm wearing today. I'm wearing size small for both pieces and the color olive and it fits me perfectly. The material is incredibly soft and stretchy, which is perfect for all the activities that I personally enjoy like running, yoga, or for just running around with my dogs. The seamless knitting makes it really comfortable and durable, so I know that I'll be wearing this one for many years to come. If you don't know already, Organic Basics is a carbon neutral, Copenhagen based company creating underwear, activewear, and everyday essentials. All of the clothing is made with organic, recycled, and eco friendly materials. They put sustainability at the core of everything they do. I was so excited when they reached out to me because I have been loving and supporting them for a while now, as some of you guys know from my capsule wardrobe videos. I think they're an example of an amazing ethical clothing company for their sustainability practices, quality, and affordability. I especially love that all of their designs are very simple, minimal, and comfortable, which is everything that I look for when I want to add more pieces into my capsule wardrobe. If you guys are interested to find out more, please check out their collection. I'll leave all the links to the products in the description below, and there's a 10% discount code for you as well. It's sponsorships like this that make it possible for me to create more videos, so just want to say thank you to Organic Basics for sponsoring this video. Between editing my videos, social media, and working from home, I've been glued to my screen more than usual since the beginning of last year. Can you guys relate? Because if so much of my life revolves around technology, I knew I had to be more intentional with my screen time moving forward. No matter what I'm working on, I try to take breaks twice a day, once in the morning and another in the afternoon. I'll either go for a walk, make some more coffee, 
This really forces me to step away from my many screens and gives my eyes a chance to rest and reset. The 20-20-20 rule. Every 20 minutes spent using a screen, try to look away at something that is 20 feet away for a total of 20 seconds. Ever since adopting a more minimalist lifestyle, I spend less of my precious time cleaning and putting things away. I routinely declutter and I've gotten rid of a lot of things that I don't need. For all the things that remained, it has its own place in my home, so I spend less time looking for things through a messy home. Simplifying my space has had a huge impact in simplifying my life. Most of the time, I can come home to a clutter-free space and completely relax. I know that not everyone has their own place. Maybe you have kids, live with a roommate, or live in a family home. I think it's good to start with what you have control over. We can reduce our clothes, books, paper clutter, even digital clutter, and start organizing them the best that we can doesn't have to be perfect, but it's a step in the right direction. Did you know that the slow living movement started in Italy? It emphasized traditional food production techniques to counter the fast food movement. We can start embracing the slow food movement by eating more clean, simple, healthier foods and swapping out processed and junk foods. Not only is it healthier, I feel like in the process we develop a better relationship with the food that we eat. If you feel like you don't have time because you have a busy schedule or you don't always feel like cooking, I highly recommend meal prepping. Try this for a week and see if this method works for you. I feel like prepping my meals in advance saves me so much time and money, but also I love that I'm in full control of what goes into my body. I have to admit, with everyday stresses and my busy schedule, I wasn't always the best at keeping in touch, but with everything that's going on in the past couple of years, I made it one of my goals to put more effort into nurturing the relationships in my life, to show people in my life how much I love and care about them. Something as simple as checking in with my friends and family I haven't talked to in a while, being attentive when listening to their problems, daily phone calls with my parents, and random messages to tell them that I'm thinking of them. These are small acts, but they can show people how much we care about them and they can make a huge difference in their lives as well as ours. I got carried away with work and if I don't remind myself, I could keep going all night. Since I don't have a strict 9 to 5 schedule, I made a little rule for myself to clock out every evening and stop whatever I'm doing always getting ahead and doing the absolute most to squeeze into our days can feel productive, but it catches up with us sooner or later. For a while, I got lost in the busyness of my life and I didn't have time for myself, but I had to constantly remind myself that life is not about work, obligations, or to-do lists. It's what I do in my free time that really defines who I am. This made me want to rekindle my love for poetry, painting, slow down to drink a cup of tea, play music, and just be inspired again. I don't have a lot of trouble waking up, but the challenge has always been to go to sleep. This is why I have a calm evening routine to prepare my body and mind to go to bed because there is so much stimulation during the day. Getting sufficient sleep and keeping a regular sleeping schedule is a non-compromise. 
I take my sweet time doing my evening skincare routine, drinking tea, reading a book or talking with my husband, and crawl into my comfy sheets around 11 o'clock. It's been a bedtime routine that I've been enjoying, and my body knows exactly when it's time to unwind. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I really hope that you enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments if you have any healthy habits that has really helped you. Just as a reminder, I will leave all the links to the Organic Basics products in the description below. There's also a 10% coupon for you if you are interested. Until next time guys, take care and I'll talk to you soon. Bye!